Hey, it's Jason. We're back for another unboxing. Today, we're going to take a look at Lagoon, Land of Druids. Now, to be honest, I know absolutely nothing about this game, but I picked it up because look at that art. It just looks cool. It is a game by Three Hairs Games for one to four players, ages 14 and up. Let's take a good look at the back of the box. We've got some hex, some tiles, some counters, some paper. Lagoon is the first world that ever was. Boundless spiritual entry flows through the land and is the source of all the world's magic. All was in balance until divinity was split by the rise of humanity into three energies that now vie for domination of Lagoon. And then it lists these three types of energies. It is up to humanity's druids to unify Lagoon. Hmm. It's a game about forging the destiny of the world. Well, it doesn't get more epic than that, does it? Wow. Position yourself on the right side of destiny and you win. Okay, well. Let's get out the tool and see what's in there. Okay. That looks familiar. Hmm. Okay, we've got a rule book. Pretty rule book. Components. Double sided tiles. Druid tokens. Seed tokens. Player reference. Player markers. Okay. Okay, we're not. Yeah, as with my other unboxings, we're not really looking at how to play the game because I haven't tried it yet and I don't think you want me to just read the instruction book to you. But it looks like, wow, see, I haven't played this type of game actually, believe it or not. I, lots of board games, card games, but these putting together hex tiles, I haven't played any of these, so this will be my first. It looks, looks pretty cool though. All right, well, enough of the book. And what is this? Must be a little cheat sheet. Okay. We've got, oh, bags, that's cool. Ha, huh. that's actually pretty thoughtful of them. A nice fancy bag, kind of like what comes in Horrified or in uh, Talisman Legendary Tales. I kind of like these components that they've been including too. And now, what do we have here? Are these player cards? Player reference, okay. Okay, they said something about three types of druids, didn't they? So these must be them. Look at this guy. Let's take a better look at these. Okay. I wonder if these are the same on all three sides. Uh... Look at that, see that is cool. When you kind of mix sci-fi and fantasy with floating cubes and things like that, that is always cool. Look at that, that'd make a nice background, wouldn't it? Okay, and the other one is, oh, these two look just, okay. Look a lot alike, huh. okay. Very cool. Oh, we got another one, okay. Whoa, that guy's funny. Hello, hi there. What's your name? Okay, I'll stop. Okay, now what do we have? Oh, wow. These hex tiles are huge. Man, looking at the back of the box, I would have thought they were about the size of a quarter. So this game could take up a lot of space. Like, and uh, if you've watched my other unboxings, I don't usually punch these cards out until we need them, so I, I don't punch them out on these. They are two-sided, they're upside down. Um, just to see what one looks like. Hmm. Okay. I, I know I said I like the art, but man, I really like the art on these. Look at that. That's 
so cool. What else do we got? Have just more, more tiles. Beautiful painting. Let's see what else. And oh, that's it. All of these are punch outs. Okay, well, let's take a look at a few more then, just because we have time. I won't even try to guess what these things do. Look at that guy. <laughs> That's so cool. Nice little tower. Okay, that's it. We have a bunch of tiles to punch out. Uh, th this is nice, it's not a whole bunch. It looks like it'll be a really easy setup and take down. So that's always good. You, have, you know, some of those games seem like they'll take an hour to put away after you're done and an hour to set up. So. But this doesn't seem that way. This seems like a nice quick game. It said, I think it said an, an hour to play. Uh, yeah, 60 minutes to play. One to four players. I'll, I'll learn how to play and I'll do a solo run to give you a sample of it then sometime. And, uh, but with that said, I guess that's it. Not a lot in this box to go over, which is cool. So, thank you so much for watching and supporting our site. It'd be nice if you smash that subscribe button so you don't miss the next video. And until then, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.